Hello, guys. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hi, Gonzalo. How are you? Hello, Hi, teacher. teacher. Hi, Galileo. Nice to see you, Gonzalo. Nice to see you, Galileo. Hoy Eduardo ya está en casita, hoy no nos va a sacar el susto. Ya no. Caridad, ayer era así como... Hello, teacher. Hi, Galileo. Y, hola, ¿cómo están? <risa> Qué barbaridad, viendo la pantalla ahí en moto. No, Ay, hay no, que... no, horror, a mí casi que me da algo. <risa> yeah, I can't believe it. All right, Carlos Alfredo, hello, how are you? Hello, um, Soso. Soso, why? What I'm happened? Tired? tired? <laughs> yes. Today is a, a long day. <laughs> it was a long day? Yes. Oh no, a lot of work to do? Sorry? A lot of work to do? Um, yes, we have a lot of work and many. When, okay. I, when I don't man, uh, when a man is young, isn't tired. <laughs> yeah. True. All right. I hear you. <laughs> yeah. Very good. Yeah, you're right. But you know what? Sometimes we get tired, even if our, um, our minds are young. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, so, I'm, no, I'm so, so young. <laughs> You are young, you're very young. All right, okay, so Carlos, um, Carlos Alfredo, what are you in charge of in your office? What do you do? Uh, I'm uh, in charge of uh, many, uh, many actions, many projects. For example, okay. I attend uh, customers. Okay. The, the most, the big part of, part of the day and uh -huh. And many times I review projects to another countries. For example, recently we launched a uh, application in Honduras. Oh, okay. And we need training the new. You need to train the new employees. The new employees. All right. Okay. All right. Very good. How long have you been working there for, Carlos? Um, one year and a half. Oh, okay. And how do you like it? Yes. Ah yes, I like it. <laughs> we do many things, many different things. And yeah. for example, recently I tried to learn uh, dark science to analytics. Okay. And the company is open for for okay. All right. Okay. But I need huh. vacations. <laughs> yeah, but you're not going to have holidays next week, or you will. And yes, I have two weeks. Uh, two days, sorry. Okay. And the next week I have uh, eight days of vacations. <laughs> yeah, Carlos, very good. All right, that's nice. Yeah. You're gonna rest. Okay, what about uh, Galileo? Are you gonna have holidays next week or you never have holidays? <laughs> Galileo, your microphone is off. Thank you, teacher. Yeah. I'm gonna take a couple days. Next week. Thursday and Friday. Okay. Yes. All right. That's good. And and uh, Saturday and and Sunday. Okay. Yeah. Day. All right. Uh, so you're gonna have a, a long weekend. Yeah, I hope. I hope yeah. so. <laughs> so you're gonna go to uh to Sulutan. Yes, I hope uh, go to Sulutan. Thursday. Right. Okay. At, at morning. In the morning. In, In the, the morning. morning. In the mo morning. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, Galileo? You forgot yeah. your presentation. No, oh, no. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Judith, what about you? Are you going to have vacation next week or not really? I think. You I think? Hope so. <laughs> you hope so. We, we, we have day off on the end, holidays, but. Mm, my boss told me that mm -hmm. uh, she she will give me uh -huh. things uh, Tuesday if I finish my my 
if you finish activities on, on Monday. <laughs> oh, okay. So you have to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you have to finish, all right? Yeah. Okay. I have to. <laughs> yeah, of course. I'm sure you will. All right, guys. Very good. So um, just like to remember or to remind you, to more Sandita, hello, Guillermo, hello, all right, and Omar, and Edwin, Rosillito, no le había dicho buenas noches por estar hablando con Carlitos y con Galileo. Very good. Okay, so guys, remember that tomorrow is the last day, all right? Así que por nada del mundo, mañana no tiene excusa, ustedes se portan súper bien y siempre están. De hecho, hay unos que van invicto, ¿verdad? Súper. All right, Judith, Judith va invicta, ¿verdad? Todos los días, ¿verdad, Judith? Sí. ¿Cómo? ¿O ha faltado alguno? No, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo? No ha faltado ningún día. No. No, ya. Galileo. <laughs> en la mano, Galileo, because that's not true. You missed two classes, Galileo. Yeah. Two yeah, Fridays. I missed two classes. I'm I'm sorry. Sorry. Ah, no, pues no se gana el sticker mañana. I'm sorry. I don't miss no more. Yeah, okay. ¿Quién más, me, ¿Quién más no me ha faltado ningún día? José Eduardo no me ha faltado ningún día. ¿Verdad que no? Uno faltó, José Eduardo. Carlita está levantando la mano. No, Carlita sí me faltó. ¿O cómo no me ha faltado, no, Carlita? Nunca le he faltado. Tita. Más le vale, Carlita. Más le vale. Carlos no, Alfredo me faltó un día, ¿verdad, Carlitos? ¿Verdad, Carlos Alfredo, que me ha faltado uno? Yeah, all right. Um, Gonzalo, yeah, so no. No me ha faltado, ¿verdad, Gonzalo? No. No, claro, también tienen sticker ganada. Very good, yeah. Rocío, sé tampoco, Rosy. Sí, uno, Rocío. Ay, Rocío, ¿qué le pasó? All right. Y Sandrita, como 10 días me ha faltado. <laughs> Dos días, very good. All right, very nice. Ok, guys, pasemos la asistencia entonces que nos corresponde de esta hora. Y luego seguimos con el manual. Rocío Adelina Cornejo de Contreras. Present. Carlos Alfredo Portillo Núñez. Present. José Eduardo Guzmán Álvarez. I'm here. Thank you. Luis Alberto Ortega Linares. A Gonzalo Valle Valle. Present. Thank you. Elmer Ubaldo Ramírez Cruz. Present. Elmer, ahí está. Eh, Edwin Balmore Flores Gómez. Present. Thank you, Edwin. Carlos Antonio Escobar Hernández. Él mm. iba invicto, pero no nos va a poder acompañar ahora. Ana Beatriz Pineda Olmedo. Anita no ha entrado aún. Sandra Ibir Monge Torres. Present. Omar Alexander González Barrera. Present. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro Corea. Mm. Hey, where's Dinora? She's sleeping already. <laughs> yeah, I, I think. Oh sleeping. no, she's sleeping. <laughs> Despierta la Galileo. Llámele, dígale que está en clase. Jose Galileo yeah. Barrera Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. All right. Otherwise, she's going to get in trouble with you tomorrow in the office. All right, uh, Jose, uh, no, Carla Marisol Escobar Arbaiza. Ah, hoy sí lo dijo bien. Uh, <laughs> es que yo no sé, Carlita, con usted siempre me equivoco, I don't know why. A ver, Ana Judith Portillo Bautista. Present. Thank you, Judith. Guillermo Alfonso Ortiz Aguilar. Está Guillermo Samuel Antonio Hernández. Thank you, Guillermo. Yes, thank you. Luis Manuel. Muñoz Acevedo, no ha entrado aún, Luis. And César Hamilton. Very good. Ok, guys. Entonces, ayer, bueno, no, sabe que antes de um, seguir con, con el repaso, mañana es el último día. Mañana hacemos la encuesta, ¿verdad? Así es que yo espero que para ahora ya todos hayan recibido ese correo donde está esa información, ¿verdad? Y para mañana ya tener listo eso cuando nos toque realizarla. Por favor, asegúrese que haya recibido esa información para no estar mañana a última hora buscando correo, ¿verdad? Mañana cuando entre, entre a su clase. Eh, yes, Jimmy. No problem. Ok. 
Eh, la idea es la siguiente, mañana cuando usted entre a su clase, aunque no vamos a hacer la encuesta, nomás entremos, pero ya tenga el correo listo, ¿verdad? Por ahí, cerca, donde usted no lo va a empezar a buscar entre mil correos, que yo sé que hay unos que nos mandan mil correos a diario, ¿verdad? Así es que asegúrese tenerlo listo por ahí. Y Sandrita, ¿por qué se ríe? Bien, ¿sabe qué cosa? Sandrita y... Que no los abro. <risa> que no. <risa> que yo no los abro. Y correo no abro. <risa> Pero ese sí, Sandrita, ese es sumamente importante, ¿verdad? Así es que téngalo a la mano mañana. Ya nomás empecemos la clase para cuando nos asignen la, la hora de, de realizar la encuesta. Entonces ya los tengamos ahí listos para eh, solo darle clic al link y empezar a llenar la encuesta, ¿verdad? Las tareas, ¿cómo vamos con las tareas? Acuérdense que como que como para hoy, ¿verdad? <ríe> Así es que ya, Sandrita, súper está, está nice, ya, yeah, very good, Galileo, todos estamos. En ese bien. día. Excelente, excelente, Edwin, very good. Gonzalo, con las tareas ya estuvieron. Cuando okay. hacemos el examen. Hola. Cuando hacemos el examen. Pues yo le recomiendo que lo haga hoy. ¿Verdad? Para que te, ya para mañana esté terminado todo. In case you cannot today, Judith, maybe tomorrow, but like everything needs to be done by tomorrow. ¿Ok? Acuérdese que... Dígame, Carlita. Este, yo estuve revisando ahora si yo iba al día y según yo sí voy al día, pero me gustaría de que si puede... Bueno, para revisar usted si, si no estoy equivocada, porque claro. yo siento que me confundo, pero para mí yo ya voy al día, hasta ya hice el examen que aparece ahí. Ah, ok, ok. ¿Sabe que En algún momento que estemos con la práctica, y ustedes estén en grupo haciendo práctica, yo puedo revisar solo para asegurar y decirle si Carlita está todo bien. Oye, all right, very good. Ok, de todas maneras puedo ver como la, el récord de todos y estar así como más pendiente aquí ahorita decirle si, si tiene alguna duda, si, lo, si estamos bien. ¿Verdad? Si es que con eso, ¿verdad? Si es que mañana, please, please, please be in class. No me haga la, la encuesta o el cuestionario ni ahora ni mañana temprano. Espérese hacerlo conmigo. Y igual recordarles que nomás se haga eso y usted lo envíe. Cuando le dé enviar, tiene que tomar una captura de pantalla donde dice enviado, donde le va a salir gracias. Usted toma la captura y abajo pone José Galileo Barrera Hernández, en el caso que José Galileo, ¿verdad? Si es José Eduardo Guzmán, José Eduardo Guzmán, y ya me manda la captura de, esa, de ese envío a nuestro WhatsApp, el grupo, de, el grupo de WhatsApp. Los que no están en grupo de WhatsApp, me lo mandan a mi personal para yo poderlo mandar a la academia, ¿all right? Otra vez, Andrita, ¿all right? Very good. No se preocupe, Sandra. Yo right. tampoco estoy en ese grupo. Ya sé, Carlita, de hecho lo dije por ustedes todos. Ah, gracias. All right, pero no se preocupe. Usted me lo manda a mí y yo lo, lo reenvío al grupo, ¿ok? All right, very good. Entonces, seguimos. Um, ayer hablamos de adjectives. We were talking about adjectives, like positive adjectives and negative adjectives, all right? Let's see. Um, Sandra, give me one positive adjective, Sandra, please. Um, uh, new? Sure, yes, very good, new, nice, very good one. Carlos Alfredo, can you give me another positive adjective? Uh, no. Which one? Oh. Sure, old, okay, old. A veces old no es malo, ¿verdad? Very good. Yeah, that's very nice. Let's see. Um, Rocío, can you give me another adjective, Rocío? Thin. Which one? Thin. Thin. Thin de delgado. Yes. All right, yeah, okay. Acuérdense que cuando hablamos de adjectives... No, hablar? clean. Ah, clean, perdón, perdón, perdón. Igual, eh, very good, Rocío, clean. Podemos hablar de adjetivos de, de, para personas, para lugares, para eh, animales, para cosas. En este caso estamos con adjectives of places, right? So clean, new, old, another one, Galileo. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Excuse me? 
Beautiful. Beautiful, yes, very nice, very good. Judith, another adjective, please. Uh, uy. Uh, crow, 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 the... Crowded, yes, crowded, very good. Edwin Balmore. Yeah, yeah, crowded, very good. Uh, Edwin Balmore, another one, please. Relaxing. Mm -hmm. Relaxing, very good. Carla, another adjective? Large. Yeah, large, very good. Omar, can you give me another adjective, please? Relaxing. Yeah, okay, very good. Elmer, another one? Near. Sure, very good. Okay, Guillermo, another one. I guess Guillermo's already busy. Delicious. Yeah, okay, sure. Okay, like talking about food, that would be nice. Beatriz, can you give me an adjective, Bea? I think Beatriz is busy right now. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, beautiful. Beautiful, yes, thank you. And Jose Eduardo, can you give me another adjective? All right, it's okay. Let's see. Um, Gonzalo, an adjective, please. Big. Big, yes, very good. Okay, let's see. Galileo, think of your office right now, okay? Think about like your, your office, your company. And can you tell me an, a sentence using either? There is, there are, the quantifier that corresponds plus an adjective, plus the name of the place. If it's the lobby, if it's the office, if it's the parking lot, you tell me. Okay. There is a, there is a big parking lot. Okay. There is uh, a big parking lot? Yeah. All right. There are, there are some bathrooms. Okay. How are the bathrooms? Are they nice? Are they elegant? Are they like uh, little? Are they modern? Uh, one bathroom is modern. Okay. And, comf and, comf and comfortable. Uncomfortable, yes, very good. Comfortable. Com comfortable. Com comfortable. <laughs> comfortable. <laughs> very good, Galileo, yes. Comfortable. Just, just only one um, uh, manager. Yours. Yeah, yeah, no, my my boss have a oh. comfortable <laughs> bathroom. Okay, all right. Yeah, uh, but there are yeah, approximately uh, six bathrooms. Six bathrooms. Okay, very yeah. good. Okay, very good. Thank you, Galileo. The yes, go ahead. Go tell me. Tell me. Uh, I. Iba a seguir diciendo otras, pero ya, la chance, pero... <laughs> That's okay. Tell me one more, Galileo. It's okay. Tell me one more. Uh, there are um, production area. Uh, a small production area. There are, Galileo, there is. Galileo, su micrófono. I'm sorry. There is... A production area. There is a production area. Okay. How yeah. is it? Is it a big production area? No, it's small, small production area. Maybe forty-eight uh, meters cuadrados. I don't know how. Ah, how... square meters. Square meters. Okay. All right. Very good. All okay. right. Interesting. Okay. Thank you, Galileo. Edwin, can you tell us? about one place in your company, in your office, you may use there is, you may use there are, a quantifier and an adjective. Um, there is a, a big, big scale for trucks. Okay. All right, and very good. Can you tell us another one? There are decks, decks. Uh, escritorios. Yes. Um, there are many computers to burn to sync. Ah, okay. All right. Okay. Very good. All right. Very good. Let's see. Uh, Gonzalo, can you tell us a sentence about your workplace? 
How many senses do you need? Sorry? How many sentences do you need? Uh, tell me two sentences. Okay. There is a little small area rest. Okay. Um, there are many. Uh huh. Um, no sé cómo dice. Tengo la idea, no sé cómo dice. Este, tenemos un banco con muchas baterías, pero no sé cómo, cómo lo digo. You have like a, is it like a storage with many batteries? There is a battery bank. Okay, all right, okay, that could be. Is it big? Is it small? Big. It's a big one. Okay, very good. Nice. Thank you. All right. Sandrita, tell me two sentences about your office, Sandra. Um, there is a relax, relaxing uh, cafeteria. Oh, nice. Very good. Yes. Um, there are mother elevator. Okay, very good. They're modern elevators. Okay, very good sentences, Sandra. Okay, yeah, only two sentences. All right, you want to tell me more? All right, very good, guys. Thank you. Okay, so now let's go back to our books here. All right, so yesterday we finished this. We finished this exercise, yes? Can you check? Yeah, all right, very good. Okay. So let's go on to page 45, <clears throat> addresses and places. I will be able to tell someone directions of where my workplace and someone else's are located. All right, so here we have employees information. We have name. Hold on, guys. All right, we have name. We have office and main phone. We have the workplace, the name. We have the address the job position, the department, and the ID, all right? So usually when we work, we have an ID number, an ID code, okay? So here we have an employee's information. So it, what is the name of this person, guys? Mauricio Quintanilla. Excuse me? Mauricio Quintanilla. Mauricio Quintanilla, very good. What is the phone office? Or the, the main office phone, the main phone office. 72039164. That's right, very good. Okay, nice. Let's see. What is the workplace? Arrows Technology Company. Arrows Technology Company, all right. And then we have the address on Roosevelt Street and First Avenue, 853 Santa Cecilia, San Salvador. All right. The job position, what is the job position? Software design, designer. Software designer, very good. And the department is? Production. Production, all right. And then you have the uh, ID, which is MQ for Mauricio Quintanilla, and then the number, all right? Okay, so here we have, it says, read again the employee's information and circle which of the alternate directions below is the correct one? Look at the map on page 39. Hold on guys, let's go back to page 39. Well, which map are they talking about? Oh, this map. Oh, okay, take a picture of this map para hacer el ejercicio de la página 45. Take a picture of this one. No nos vamos a ir a ningún lado todavía, a ningún grupo. Lo vamos a hacer en grupo aquí. So take a picture of this one. ¿Terminaron? Did you take a picture? Yes. Okay. So let's go back down. Here. Sorry, guys. Here. Okay. It is located in front of the mall on First Avenue. It is. Entonces tienen que buscar basado en el mapa que tienen ahí que está en it is que está eh, localizado que se encuentra in front of the mall on First Avenue. Vaya a ver el mapa y pone ahí si es 
the bookstore or the plaza or whatever that is. Igual for number two, number three, and number four, okay? Let me know when you finish. Gonzalo. Gonzalo, ¿me está hablando? No, yo, Eduardo. Ah, José Eduardo, perdone, perdóneme. Eh, teacher, eh, tengo problemas ahí con el internet, se me congeló el momento de, de la foto, teacher, no la pude tomar. Vaya, ahorita se la pongo, no se preocupe. Ahorita, permítame. Vaya, José Eduardo. Gracias. Ya, yeah, you're welcome. Aquí quedan las preguntas. All right, you guys finished? Yes, teacher, but All right. uh -huh. I, ha I have a doubt. Okay, doubt. let's see, doubt. what's your, what, yeah, your doubt? What's your question, Galileo? Uh, 
Uh, number two, it is located across First Avenue behind the restaurant. Mm -hmm. According to the map, behind the restaurant. And There's nothing. <laughs> there is nothing, yeah. It is located across First Avenue. Vamos a regresar porque no lo tengo aquí. It is located, well, you read the instructions, Galileo, okay? And I see the map here. It is located on First Avenue, decía, ¿verdad? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. First Avenue, behind the restaurant. Uh, behind is nothing because nothing. Uh, next to is mall, in front of is our company. Mm -hmm. Maybe, I think, I don't know. Yeah. Well, yeah, you're right. What about the rest of you guys? ¿Cómo solucionaron a la dos? <laughs> Beatriz, what did you write? No, I didn't get it. Yeah, okay. Ponga ahí, I don't know, school or something, porque no hay nada, la verdad. Atrás del restaurante, there's nothing. All right, so not here, not here. En ninguna parte de behind. Yeah, all right, okay. Thank you. There, there is an empty space. Picture. Yeah, maybe it's like a, like, yeah, no kidding, an empty space. <laughs> All right, very good. What happened to number one? Can you tell me that? Uh, let me see. Hold on. I'm going to choose someone here. Uh, Carlos Alfredo, can you tell me the number one, please? I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, it, uh, it is located in front of the mall of First Avenue. Uh, in front of the mall, it's uh, the park. Okay. All right. Very good. So in front of the mall is the park. Very good. All right. Uh, let me see. Edwin, can you read number three? Edwin, please. Um. It is located on Roosevelt Street mm -hmm. between the restaurant of Book Wars. Okay. There is, a, there is a wrong company. The Arrows Company. Yes. All right. Everybody has that? Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay. Let's see. Uh, let me see here. What about number? Do we have number four? Sir, yes. You should have a question. Uh huh. Uh, we can say we can say there is arrows company or it's necessary there is the arrow company. No, there you can say there is arrows company company. Okay. All right. You. Or we say arrows company is y da la, da, da la instrucción de donde está. Okay. Thank you. Very good. Elmer, can you do the last one? Creo que son cuatro, son cinco. Es que no las tengo en pantalla ahorita. Four. Four. Okay, very good. Elmer, can you do number four? Let me see, teacher. Yes. Is that I don't, I don't take the picture uh, the of the question. questions. Oh, okay, that's okay. Let's see. Um, Rocio, what about you? Do you have number four? Uh -uh. No. No. All right. Um, Sandra, do you have number four? No, not terminé. Okay, very good. Um, I don't know. Who has number four? It is a church. What was that? Can you tell me the instructions, Galileo? Okay. Uh, give me a second, please. It is located along Roosevelt Street, next to the city uh, hall and the park. Next to the city hall and the park, uh, a church. There is a church. Yeah, there is a church. All right. Yeah, very good. Okay. All right, very good, guys. Okay, we're gonna go back here on page 45. All right, so, okay. ¿Se acuerdan que ayer creo que empezamos a ver las otras prepositions of place, okay? Aquí hay otras, 
Acuérdense que de hecho hay un montón. Okay, so he, uh, where is the park located? And we can say it is located among many places. Among es similar, no es igual. Eh, bueno, no, podemos decir entre muchos lugares. Among es entre, no de entrar, sino que de al, alrededor de muchos lugares. In front of, la segunda donde dice where is the sport palace located? It's located on Barrios Street in front of the park. Where is the mall located? It's located near the restaurant. Where is the church? Uh, where is the church? It's located past the school. Entonces, near es cerca y past es como después de la escuela, ¿verdad? It's like past the, the, the school there, okay? Igual, vamos a ver. Le tomaron foto a la, al mapa, ¿verdad? Le tomaron foto al mapa. Yes. Yes. Ok, entonces, este, oh, esta, yes. este ejercicio que está aquí siempre tiene que ser referente, referente al mapa. Entonces, este, si no tiene el manual, si gusta, tómele foto a esto. Y le voy a poner un ejercicio más para que nos podamos ir a los grupos y hacer ese, este ejercicio y el otro que yo les voy a dejar. So, take a picture now. Finished? ¿Se tomaron fotos? Ya, yeah. ok. Y deme un segundito aquí en lo que con lo, el otro mapa que vamos a trabajar. Excuse me, teacher. Elmer. Me copia, Elmer. Hola, hola, Gonzalo. Este, voy, voy a trabajar un ratito. All right, Gonzalo, that's okay. Alright guys, eso es lo que vamos a trabajar ahorita. Ok. A ver, a ver, a ver. Can you take a picture of this? Ok. Finish taking the picture? Yes. Okay. Finish, Carlita? Okay. And now, take a picture of this. Estas son las... Ya le voy a explicar. Eh, wait, guys. Okay. Estas son las preguntas. Por ejemplo, yo estoy trabajando con Beatriz y Beatriz me va a hacer las preguntas a mí. Where is the train station? Y vamos a venir y buscar el train station y vamos a decir the train station is y podemos decir in front of the school on central avenue como usted vaya eh, vayan um, haciendo las juntas o juntos no lo hagan individual verdad la idea es trabajar y ayudarse is the drugstore across from the library dependiendo de la de la pregunta si van a ir contestando ok entonces, tómenle foto a esta parte de acá. ¿Ya? Ok. Entonces, vamos a hacer ahorita la, el, lo del manual y esta práctica que está aquí. ¿Ok?
Main Street. On the Main Street. Mm -hmm. In front of the police station. In front of. In front of police, the police station. station. In front of police station. Station. Uh -huh. next, next to the post office. Between. Between. Between, Between post office and movie theater. And movie theater. Yes. Between post office and movie theater. theater. Sandrita, okay. what happened, Sandrita? No, la oigo. Number three. No, teacher. Mm. Sandrita, Sandrita is the person who asks or repeat the question. Ajá, or, ok. Or the, <laughs> yeah. Ok, aquí me quedo para oírla, Sandrita. Ok, number three, Sandrita. Number three. Where is the post office? Where is the post office? Carlos. Post office. And the post office, post office is in is... corner of the first street and main street. Okay. It is uh, corner. Corner. Of first street. First street and main street. And main street. The the address is really exact, exactly. Uh, so I think we need exact, we, eh, Galileo. Perdón? Exact. Uh, exact. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the ad the address is really exact. So I think we don't need add all the reference. Okay. I think. okay. And the reference is in front of, uh, in front yeah, of the bank. Because it's in the, in the angle. In the angle of first street and main mm. street is, is, is exactly. We don't need uh, say next to the drugstore in front of the bank, etc. I think we don't need uh, it. OK. Yeah, so I was trying to talk. Number four, no Sandrita. Sandrita. Vamos. What is the four? Uh, number Where four. Is the throne? Church. Church? Church. 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 C-H-U-R-C-H. Church. 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 Así casi como que se lee. Así como se lee. What is the church? Where is the church? Church. Um, what, is, what is the church? What is the church? Um, the church yeah, is right. in the end of the world. Solo faltó Carlita, ¿verdad? Y hombre, ¿qué pasó aquí? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, we're really missing her. The church, the church is... is uh, on the second street. On the uh, second street and next to the uh, hospital. Next to the hospital or in the corner of Central Avenue and the second street. Exactly. I, there in are front many, of the hospital. many options Hospitals. to make the reference. Okay. Uh, uh, what we can use? What reference we can use? Okay. Is the is uh, in the corner of Central Avenue and Second Street. Carlos, Sandrita, or next to hospital. It's, it's, it's more easy, I think. Um, say say a reference with the, in the Salvadorian hospital. In the Salvadorian speakers <laughs> in front of the hospital. <laughs> exactly. <Yes. laughs> next to, I, I hope, I, I think, um, next to, because in front 
the hospital is the restaurant and movie theater. Behind is an empty space and, and next to maybe is the church. What do you think, Alfredo? Alfredo? And I think in, um, in front of, oh, uh, uh, in front next, of the next, next to the church, what do you think? Ah, I'm sorry, next to the, the hospital. Um, it's currently says the next to. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I think it's next to, for example, next to. No, yes. you say next to, but I, mm. teacher, I have uh, this question. In front, it's correctly in front said. the restaurant. What happened? It's the, correct, it's the, correctly. The question is, uh, where is the church? The church is next to the hospital. Next but to the hospital, huh? It's okay. Yes, it's the church fine. is next to the hospital. Ah, okay. okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, number five, Sandrita. Sandrita, number On five. Time. Number five. Okay. In the store next in to the, the store police. next to the police station. Yeah, in the store next to the police station, Carlos. Uh, the store is in the main street. No, the question no. is yes or no. Yeah. Is, the, is the store next to the police station? Yes, it is. Yes. Uh, yes, the question, the answer is yes. Police yes, station it is. is next to the police station. Yeah. Short answer is yes, it is. I think. Okay. Number six. Uh, okay, vamos. Where is the drug store? Where is the drug store? Drug mm -hmm. there is. The drug store mm -hmm. is between the post office yeah. and the movie theater. Theater. Yes. The drug store is between in front of the police station. Post office. Of police station. Post yes. office and movie theater. No. Okay. Uh, number seven, Sandrita. Okay, veamos. This is the school between the store and the crunch, crunch, church. Church. <laughs> and the church. 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 Is, is this the school between the store and the church? And the church. Is the school between the store and the church? That was. Is the school no, between. It's not. The school between the store and the church negative. That no, is negative. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, no it's not. It's not. Okay. Number eight. Okay. Sandrita. Nueve. Number nueve. Eight. Eight. Eight, 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 eight. Where is the hospital? Where is the hospital? Uh, the hospital is in the second avenue. Okay. Uh, next to the movie theater and the restaurant. In the second on the second avenue. Uh huh. In Next front. to the movie theater. In front. No, in front of, I hope, I, I think the, the main uh, enter, the main access is in front of the street. So, 
in front of the hospital is the movie theater, movie theater and restaurant. What do you think? But. Uh, but. I the hospital but. is on the second avenue in front of or next to the church. What do you prefer? Uh, next to the church. It's the, next to the church. Okay. The okay. short answer. <laughs> yeah, next to the church. Number nine, Sandrita. Okay. Number nine. Where is the res restaurant? Where is the restaurant? Where is the 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 the? What is the the the? What the. is the restaurant? Exactly. <laughs> Como que era de, pero con la lengua enfrente, de. What is the restaurant? Se dice de si la siguiente palabra es vocal. Where is the restaurant? The, Where is the uh, restaurant? restaurant. Oh, I'm very sorry. The restaurant, ah. Uh. It's a mon, another, other. <laughs> other places. Where is the restaurant? is on the central oh, no. avenue next to the school in the corner of the second street and central avenue okay the next restaurant to the is on the central avenue right? the central, central avenue avenue second street uh-huh yes only or next to the school we can add add up uh, next to the school. Next, what next to the school. May I? Next to next. the school. Next number nine. Number ten. Sandrita. Where is the store? What is where is the store? Alfredo. Mm. The store is store, store, um, on the store is in the main street. Main street. Uh, next to the police station. Next to police station. Yeah, we got it. What are the other practice? The other question. Uh, uh, that is all. <laughs> okay, we finish. Before no, you must. No more. Only yeah. 10 cents. ¿Y el del libro? Ajá, es que sí hace falta una foto. Ah, el, de la, el del libro, el del manual. Ah, sí, donde es, tenemos es, que poner alone, in front, begin, next to, ajá, y otro. Yeah, it's it, the, the four question. The sport palace is, sport palace is among the bank or in front of or near or past. There are four prepositions of places. And the one has the... Do you have the, the, the... Do you have the... The picture? Partners? Me no. Do you want me to share the picture? Okay, I... Can I share my screen? Okay. Okay. It is. Uh, the, can you see it? Can you see the screen, Alfredo, Sandrita? Um, yep. The screen. Uh, there are two prepositional place. Among, in front of, near, past. Mm -hmm. There are four questions or sentences. Uh, this number, poor place. Number one is, is the sport yeah. play. The, the sport palace sport is palace. the bank. Where I almost understand the bank. Está the sport palace uh, bank. Aquí arriba. Uh, bank. Here. Where the sport palace. Where is the sport <laughs> palace? I think there is now the the map. Uh, another map. Another map, another map, another map. Sport Palace, here is. Can you see it? Uh, I guess it's for, Sport uh -huh. yeah. yes. It's another map. It's another uh -huh. map. Uh, mm -hmm. The question is the Sport Palace is. Sport Palace. 
is, is um, between or among between in school. Let me see. Among. There is the answer. Between. But we between. have the complete ah, complement. We, we must uh, use among, in front of, clear, or fast in this uh, exercise. Yeah. We have a, a complement of the... Uh, Pero aquí abajo salen otros, sería between. The, the is, store products ah, is the bank. Is. Okay. Sería... Uh -huh. Okay, between. Teacher. Between is similar to among. No, es que between no. es precisamente en medio. Okay. ¿verdad? Pero among. among es como entre muchos edificios, ah. no necesariamente en medio. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. It's between. This four palace is between, let me see, uh, a school and the bank. This four palace is the number one. This four palace is between. Uh, school in the bank is but we have the complement and this bank. exercise and uh, the bank in this case i think is for palace is uh in front of the bank or next to the bank uh -huh. i think it's in front of yeah in front of the bank you have the reason. According to the map. Palace is in front, the front of the park. From bank. Uh -huh. Galileo. Bank. Uh -huh. ¿Qué le acaba de decir a Carlos Alfredo usted? Que tiene razón. Yeah, you have the reason. Uh -huh. Esa, eh, eso se dice mejor cuando usted dice you are right. You are right. Uh -huh. Porque cuando Entendido. decimos you have the reason es bien traducido. What mean bien traducido? Así como que tú o usted tiene razón. You have the reason. <laughs> okay. All right. You're right. You're right, exacto. You're, You're right. right. Mm -hmm. You're okay. right. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. You're right, Carlos. The, the sport <laughs> palace is in front of the bank. In front. In front. In front. In front. Yeah, it's in front of the bank, I think. Yeah. Or next to no next to. This uh, the sport palace is in front. Is next to sport palace next to the bank. Are you agree, Carlos Andrita? Uh, yeah. The sport palace is. Galileo otra. Next <laughs> Thank you. I I I need to learn. No, Thank you. Know you. Tell me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Tell <It's>, me. <laughs> so they don't pay attention, verdad? It's do you agree? Do you agree? Do you agree? Ah. Do. Lo que pasa es que también lo hacemos bien traducido. En español decimos estás de acuerdo. Estás de acuerdo. Por eso preguntamos are you agree? Ah. Pero es do you agree? Es un verbo. Yo, Agree Yo siempre he dicho, are you agree? Claro, he estado equivocado. <laughs> Do you agree? Do you agree? The uh -huh. correct way That's to Yeah, entonces it. en el caso de Carlos y Sandra dijeran, yes, we are. Mm -hmm. ¿Verdad? O yes, we do. I mean, uh, do you agree? Yes, we do. Sorry. Yes, we do. We do agree. Thank you. Acuérdense yeah. que agree es un verbo. Yeah. Por eso no lo podemos combinar con are. ¿Cierto? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Entonces... Do you Para, para decir, tienes razón, you are right. Para decir, está yeah. de acuerdo, do you agree? Do you agree? Thank you. I en got it. De, yeah, en el caso de Sandrita, por ejemplo, usted le podría preguntar a Carlos, does she agree? Uh -huh. Entonces ya Carlos le dijera, yes, mm -hmm. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. I'm sorry. Thank you. All my life I say it. Really? Yeah, okay. That's you a very agree. common mistake many people make. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, the sport palace is next to the bank. Do you agree? Next to the uh, bank. Sport palace right. next to the bank. Okay, the sport palace is In next front. to the bank. A la par del banco. Sue. Yes. Sue, yes. Sandrita. This is this, this, come on, this city, city, the city, police, the strong, yes. and the book board. The city hall is between city hall. Here is here is city hall. City the, hall. the sentence says the, the city the hall is the children's book board. It's a between. City Hall, Book Hall, and Church is between. Do you agree? Uh, let's see. Yes, I'm happy. <laughs> okay, the the City Hall is between. Uh, church and book, book board. Church and book board. Church and book board. Hi, Rocio, Mar, and Luis. You know, guys, finished? Hi, teacher. Hi, Rocio. Did you finish, Rocio? No, estamos eh, prácticamente sobre eh, que si la tienda, no, que si la escuela está entre la tienda y la iglesia. Uh -huh. Es que yo fui, me moví porque fui a traer los auriculares, casi no, no escucho por el ruido que hay aquí. Ok. <risa> sí. Hola, yo, no, yo me acabo, de, buenas noches, yo me acabo de conectar. Sí, Luis, vi que entró. A ver, estamos con eso eh, del mapa y tratando de dar como ubicación, ¿verdad? No sé si no tiene usted no tiene usted la foto completa, Luis. Eh, no, no, no lo tengo. A ver, ahorita sí. lo estaba, estaba compartiendo una y ahorita la, la eh, está compartida, creo que está compartida. Este, sí, estoy compartiendo las preguntas, pero si quiere le comparto el mapa en, en, en un mensaje. Ok. Vale, un segundo. Ay, pero... No, no se las puedo poner. Si gusta, se las comparto. Eh, Hágame el sí. favor. Sí, voy a dejar sí, de compartir bueno. su pantalla y comparto okay. yo la mía solo para enseñarle al compañero. A ver, Luis, este sería el mapa. Hágale, toma su. Ok. Y esas que están acá son las mismas que estaba compartiendo Rocío, que son las preguntas. Ah, ok, perfecto. Okay. Eso sí, la, el mapa no lo tenía. Ah, ok, great. De todas maneras, en un minutito más, aunque no logremos terminar, vamos a regresar para corregir las que tenemos y luego seguimos, ok? Ok, teacher. Thank you. <coughs> Ahí está. Okay.
All right, Galileo, Carlos, Alfredo, Sandrita, you finished? Yes, teacher. All right, yes. Great. Okay, nice. All right, we're just going to wait for everybody to come back. So we can take the attendance that we were supposed to take a while ago. Do you agree, Galileo? Yes, I do, teacher. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> All right, you will never forget. You're, you're right. You're right. Yes, thank you. <laughs> I'm not going to say I'm always right because that's not true. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, very good. I'm going to take the attendance right now, then we're going to check. All right, so we have Rocio Adelina Cornejo de Contreras. I'm here. Carlos Alfredo Portillo Nunez. Present. Jose Eduardo Guzman Alvarez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Luis Alberto Ortega Linares. Gonzalo Valle Valle. Elmer Ubaldo Ramirez Cruz. Present. Thank you. Edwin Balmore Flores Gomez. I'm here. Carlos Antonio Escobar Hernández. Ana Beatriz Pineda Olmedo. Present. Eh, Sandra Judith Monge Torres. Omar Alexander González Barrera. Present. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro Corea. She's really sleeping. <laughs> José Galileo Barrera Hernández. Present. Carla Marisol Escobar Arbaiza. Lo dije bien. Present. Ana Judith Portillo Bautista. Present. Guillermo Alfonso Ortiz Aguilar. I'm here, teacher. Samuel Antonio Hernández Mancía. Luis Manuel Muñoz Acevedo. And Cesar. Luis Manuel is not here, right? No. And Cesar Hamilton Rodriguez Castillo. All right, guys, let's see. Let's check this together. Vemos primero el más corto, que era del libro. Y luego vemos el más largo que era el que yo les di del mapa. Solo déjenme ponerles el manual otra vez. Here we go. All right, okay, so here we have complete the conversation using a preposition from the box, go to page 39 and look at the map, okay? So number one, Judith, the, po the sport palace is? Mm, next to the bank. The sport palace is next to the bank. Can you the map right now with me? Is that correct? It's next to the bank, yes? Yeah? All right, yes. very good. Number two, the city hall. Uh, Carla Marisol, the city hall is. Carlita? No, maybe she's with the baby right now. <laughs> All right, uh, Omar, number two, the city hall is. No. No, no, sé, no, 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 Ah, okay, okay, that's okay. Beatriz, the city hall is us. It's past the church and the book and book world. No, past the, the, the street. Wait, wait. I, I'm sorry, Anita, I cannot hear you, Beatriz. <laughs> okay, that's okay. The city hall is past. Pass the, the church and the book world, and book world. All right. Let's see, Galileo, can you do, all right, can you do no, number no, no, three? No, 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 it's wrong, it's wrong, it's wrong, it's between. It's between, ah, uh, it's between the church and book world. I just want to see it. Just... Wait, 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 wait,
the city hall and the book world and we were looking for the church Maybe. we are looking for for the city hall we're looking for the city hall the city hall mm -hmm. is i don't remember where the city hall is anymore. between the church and it's between the, the church and the book world i'm sorry guys all right what about the restaurant um carlos Carlos Alfredo, can you do number three? The restaurant is? Okay, the number three. The restaurant is? Sorry, sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, sorry, I just, okay. Okay. Oh, first avenue. Um, the restaurant is in the end, is correct, say this. At the end, maybe, at the end, yes. Pero hay otra por ahí que podríamos usar, fíjese. You can say along. Along, oh. sorry, uh -huh. along. <laughs> yeah, the restaurant is along First Avenue, all oh. right, very good. And what about for the church and the city hall are? Anybody? In front of the park. Yeah, in front of the park. Perfect. Very good. In front of the park. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing this one. And then we can share. I'm going to share the other one. Que era el mapa que yo les compartía. All right, so here's the map, guys. Places in the city. So here, we're supposed to, like, look at this map. And then we have the questions. Number one, where is the train station? Anybody that wants to answer that question, where is the train station? The train station is in front of a school on yes. Central Avenue. On Central Avenue, very good. Acuérdese que no vamos a decir in Central Avenue, ¿verdad? Porque está sobre, on Central Avenue, in front of the school. Very good. Number two, guys, is the drugstore across from the library? No, it isn't. No, it isn't, right? No, it is not. All right, the drugstore is across from the police station. Certo. All right, number three. Where is the post office, Sandra? Where is the post office? It is... Uh, it's a corner. Corner. Very good, Jose Eduardo. Uh -huh. Continue, Sandrita. Very good. Uh -huh. Sandrita is? Third Street. It's on the corner of First Street and? And what, Sandra? Um, Central Avenue. It's in the corner. Aquí estamos, ¿verdad? No, no está en Central Avenue. The post office is here. It's on the corner of First Street and Ah, Main Street. And Main, Main Street, Street, right? Es en la esquina exacta, on the corner of. All right. La de abajo le estaba diciendo. <laughs> Está en la esquina, solo que en la esquina opuesta. Very good. Where is, where is the church? It's on Where is the church, guys? The church is next, the is next to the hospital. It's next to the hospital? Or we can say is? Between Central Avenue and Second, Second Street. Sure. On the corner. Okay. On the corner, that's corner. better. On the corner of Central Avenue, Second oh, Street, no. across from the hospital, in front of the hospital, very good. Next to the hospital, many prepositions that we can use there, okay? Let's continue here. Number five, is the store next to the police station? Yes. yes, it is. Yes, it is. 
Excelente, Carlita. Very good. Oh, yes, my, it is. Es que tuve un buen maestro ahora. Ah, excelente. Very otro, good. Otro, pues, otro. otro. <laughs> y Galilea hace como, excuse me, right? <laughs> All no, right, como ya no me quiere. <laughs> ah, no. He loves everybody. All right, very good. Okay, next one. Eh, where is the drugstore, guys? On Main Street between office and movie theater. Excellent, Beatriz, very good. It's on Main Street between the post office and the movie theater. Very good, very good. Thank nice, thank you. Um, where is, no, is the school between the store and the church? Oh, it's not. No, it isn't, right? This is the school? No, it's not, very good. Next one, where is the hospital? Rocio, where is the hospital, Rocio? Are you the main esa? Um, Sylvia so yeah, is located mm -hmm. in, no, on Second Street. Okay. Eh, ay, esa palabra se me olvida. Entre, um, entre Main Street. And in Central Avenue. Okay, like you can say between Central Avenue between and Second Street. You can say it is on Second Street. You can say it's across from the movie theater and the restaurant. Okay, many prepositions there. Thank you. Very good, Rocio. Uh, Elmer, where is the restaurant, Elmer? Elmer? Uh, isn't teacher? Hola? To listen. No? no? I mean, ahorita sí. No sé si había dicho algo antes. Sí, que voy en el transporte. Ah, ok, ok, that's ok. Don't oh, worry about it. That's ok, okay. that's ok. Solo por eso le vamos a decir a José Eduardo y después a Edwin. All right, José Eduardo, where is the restaurant, José Eduardo? Mire, aquí está. This is the restaurant, José Eduardo. Where is? Where is it is it is a corner is oh. gone to it? No. Come on. Sí, ahí va bien. Va, va, va muy bien. It's on the corner of the second Second Street, Second Street, street yeah, and Central S Avenue. Excellent, Jose Eduardo. Very good. Excellent. Very nice. Jame. Very good. Edwin Balmore, can you do the last one? Where is the store, Edwin? Uh, it is location past the, the police station okay. on Main Street. Perfect. It is past the uh, police station. On Main Street, también podríamos decir eso. It is on the corner of Main Street and Second Avenue. It is across from the movie theater or in front of the movie theater. Mucho is next to the police station. O así como dijo Edwin, past the police station. Super excellent, Edwin. Very good, guys. De repente está en español cuesta dar direcciones. ¿Verdad? Yo no sé ustedes, pero de repente es como que difícil dar direcciones, ¿verdad? Y más con nosotros así como por el árbol de mango, y hay muchos árboles de mango, all right? So, yeah, sure. it's a little bit difficult. Yes, Galileo. Can you explain uh, 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 un poco más ¿Sí? sobre across, la palabra across? Ah, ok. Ok, uh, uh, a veces tendemos a confundir, digamos, el across from, ese sería... Ok, el across from y el in front of, ok. Ahorita podríamos decir, I am in front of you, ¿cierto? Podríamos decir, si usted, enfrente de su oficina hay un edificio de apartamentos, entonces usted dice, in, uh, there is um, an apartment building in front of my office. my office, thank you. But across from, por lo general nos cruzamos la calle. All right, entonces esa es como la... Mm, difference between in front of and across from. All right, porque a veces puede estar como enfrente y no necesariamente hay una calle que nos cruzamos. All right, en el caso de ahorita, como les decía, I am in front of you. 
All right. O si usted tiene la computadora, está enfrente de usted, o su celular, o su tablet. All right. It's in front of you. Um, but if you have to cross the street, then it's better to use across from. Thank you. Teacher. All right, Galileo. Very good. Yeah. It's, okay. yeah. So sometimes it's very important to know how to give directions, porque no es nada fácil estar diciendo en la esquina, en frente de, a la par, pero al menos hay que saber las más eh, comunes, que sería in front of, behind, all right, on, ¿verdad? On, ya sea sobre, or on, sobre de algo, por ejemplo, on, like on my head, or on the street, ¿verdad? On, like in, on the corner of, or in the corner of, all right, so siempre es en la esquina, around the corner, es como que a la vuelta, ¿verdad? A la vuelta de la esquina. To the left, ya ve, to the right, to the left. Okay, so eso es importante saber la letra, lateralidad. There you go. To the right and to the left. Si va ir recto, usted le dice, por ejemplo, le preguntó a Beatriz, Beatriz, where's your office? Y me dice, eh, go straight ahead. Es como vaya recto sobre, por decirle algo, la olímpica, ¿verdad? Or whatever, right? Go straight ahead on Olympica Avenue. All right, straight ahead es ir recto. Okay, or la que veíamos. Um, excuse me? How do you say it? a la vuelta, dijo? Around, around the corner. Okay. También podemos decir, no solo decir straight ahead, sino que along es como que sobre, como sí, como along es como siempre recto. ¿verdad? Es como along the, the, the street. All right, so. Um, entonces son esas como las más, las sí. que más vemos, or next to, dígame. The pronunciation of uh, behind or behind? Behind. Be. Be. Behind. Behind. Okay, okay. it's Thanks. behind. Yes, very good. Next to, ¿verdad? Next to or in front of, across from. Entonces, todas esas son como muy, muy importantes de saber. All right. Para cuando tenemos que ubicar a alguien. Okay. Very good. Okay. Let's, we're going to continue here. Solo quiero ver una cuestión aquí en el libro. Okay. Vamos a terminar esta ahorita, la página siempre 46, la vamos a llenar aquí y luego lo que resta vamos a hacer otra práctica, pero vamos a hacer esto primero. A ver, dice employees information, complete the following infor uh, employees information about someone else. Ah, sí, entonces, ok, uh, vamos a ver, vamos a hacer dos cosas, vamos a llenarla con nuestra propia información. All right, si tiene el manual, lo puede hacer en el manual, si no solo copie, el, no tiene que hacer el cuadro, solo copie la información. Name y pone Rocío, Adelina, Cornejo, eh, de Contreras. All right, workplace, donde ustedes trabajan. O si no, ustedes se pueden inventar otra empresa, no importa. Office or main phone. Igual, usted puede poner su teléfono de verdad o se inventa uno, no hay problema. Job position, igual. Your own or another one, department, el departamento donde usted trabaja o donde, el, del cual usted pertenece, the address, an ID, si usted no tiene una, un número de ID de su empresa, igual podemos hacer uno, ok, so, hagamos esto ahorita aquí, llenémoslo con su propia información y luego ya le voy a decir qué vamos a hacer.
Chiquitín. Y el chiquitín vos. A ver, ¿dónde ando? Viendo el que habla una morida que hay allá por, por plaza, por. Guillermo, I think your microphone is on. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Sorry, so, sorry, teacher. I'm at work. I know, Guillermo, I understand. Don't worry about it. It's okay. All right, finished. Yes, all right, very good. Okay, vamos antes de, de, de regresar y hacer esta última práctica que quiero que la idea es, eso ya lo de ahorita y lo de mañana es como repaso de todo el módulo. All right, so it's very important for you to practice speaking and like, you know, kind of like doing this. So when you go to your, uh, when you go back to your groups, I want you to ask, for example, I'm going to be with, I don't know, with um, Carlos Alfredo. And I'll say, okay, Carlos Alfredo, what's your name? Como empezar desde el inicio, ¿verdad? And Carlos Alfredo is going to say, my name is Carlos Alfredo. And I'm going to say, what is your office phone or your main phone number? Y él me va a decir, my main phone number is blah, blah, blah. Uh, where do you work? Okay. And he's going to say, I work at Uber or whatever the name is. What is your job position? Y si usted le puede decir, I'm a manager, I'm a supervisor, la, la, el supuesto, que, el, el, el puesto que usted desempeña o cualquier otro. Eh, what is your department? All right. What is your address? And what is your ID? All right. This is just like so we can practice a little bit of a speaking. Okay. Because we're reviewing everything. Si usted se fija, para mañana nos toca. Sorry, guys. Para mañana nos toca página 47 y página 48 y terminamos el manual. Entonces estamos como ya en repaso. Entonces si se fijan vamos exactos donde tenemos que estar. So that's very important for you to for you guys to review, ¿ok? Entonces vamos a, a hacer esta práctica y vamos a hacer esta otra. Solo déjenme aquí para poderla compartir. Ok, y vamos a hacer esta otra. Lo más probable es que no nos alcance el tiempo porque ya casi que nos falta poquito. Pero, please, guys, do this practice, ok? Es importante que la hagan, que vayan practicando, que vayan como soltando lo poco que vamos eh, conociendo o lo que ya conocemos. Igual es importante que lo pongamos en práctica. Este es el dibujo que vamos a hacer. Le doy mucho énfasis a las, a las preposiciones del lugar para porque de repente se ocupan mucho y si alguien le pregunta, ¿dónde está tal cosa? Usted le puede decir, ah, it's under your desk, ¿ok? Entonces, aquí lo que vamos a hacer es, lo, puede avanzar lo más que pueda, obviamente, tal vez no terminemos o tal vez sí. Vea la imagen y aquí dice clock. Ahora, usted va a armar la oración, ¿verdad? Usando there is, usando there are, y usted va a decir, por ejemplo, there is a clock, va a decir in, on, or at the wall. ¿Verdad? Entonces volvemos con las preposiciones del lugar. All right. So you can say it is uh -huh. on, in, or at. ¿Qué nos correspondería con el clock? Aquí está el clock. ¿Qué preposición del lugar puedo usar? In. On the wall. On the wall. Porque si decimos in, Rocío, es como que le abrió un hoyo a la pared y metió el reloj. ¿Verdad? Sería on, porque está sobre una superficie. Muy bien, on, ¿verdad? Aparte, mire, Sandrita, ¿qué hora son? Ah, no, esa es trampa, porque se ven no cloca. Pues no, Sandrita. Si hubiera estado más complicada, sí. All right, entonces, avance con esto y con la práctica del, el, de la fichita, de la fichita que acaba de llenar. 
haciendo un par de preguntas. Si usted no haga todas las preguntas, unas tres, cuatro suficiente, ambos. All right, y luego hacemos esto acá. Ok. Teacher. Yes, Rocío. Eh, ¿Dónde estamos llenando eh, nuestra ficha? Sí. Hay una donde dice departamento, uh -huh. pero se está refiriendo al departamento del lugar de trabajo, o sea, San Salvador, o departamento de trabajo. O sea, eh, si usted trabaja en el departamento de mercadeo, de contabilidad, de, de recursos humanos, a ese departamento. Uh -huh. Ok. All right, very good. Ok. Y Carlita, en eso voy a revisar lo que me pidió para que esté tranquila con lo de las tareas. Oye. All right, very good. Seguimos con los mismos grupos. Le tomaron foto a la última, a la última imagen, ¿verdad? Sí. No. ¿Quién no le tomó? ¿Edwin no le logró tomar? No, no le logré tomar. Espéreme, Edwin. Ya, si gusta, no se vaya todavía. Eh, se lo comparto ahorita y los que no lograron tomarle, aquí está. Y los que ya le tomaron, tengan paciencia que en eso llegan sus compañeros. Ok. Thank you. You may go now to your groups. No me aparece para irme al grupo. ¿A quién no le aparece a Edwin? Yes. ¿Por qué Edwin? A ver. ¿Cómo no? Rocío tendría que estar en la sala 4, Rocío. Con Omar Alexander. Bueno, igual, ahorita la mando, Rocío. ¿No le salió? Omar está en la sala 4 con Rocío. Edwin, ¿no le salió a Edwin? No, todavía no. Está con Elmer, usted y Carlita. Sí, en la sala 1. A ver, Edwin, lo voy a mover y lo voy a volver a mover, oye, porque no lo puedo okay. redireccionar de una vez ahorita. Pero ahí vamos. Permítame. Mire, ahora si sí le salió Edwin. Para la sala 3. Vale. Eh, lo voy a volver a mover a la sala 1. Mire ahora. No, Edwin. Edwin, tiene su micrófono apagadito. Entré eh, en la sala 3, pero me sacó nuevamente. Oh, no, espérese, pues. Ahí está Carlita esperándolo. Vaya, espérame. Váyase a la sala 3, entre y luego ya cuando le vuelva a salir la invitación para la sala 1, se, se mueve. Ok. Ok. Luis Alberto, ¿con quién estaba? ¿Se recuerda? En el grupo. Hola. Hola Luis, ya lo mandé, no le, no le sale la invitación. No, no, no me acuerdo con quién estaba. Es que lo, lo acabo de mandar con Rocío porque ella está sola ahorita. No le sale la invitación. Ahorita voy. Ah, ok.
Okay. Luis Alberto, ¿han rocío todo bien? Sí. Ok. Sí, no, la, la, la foto estábamos ahí viendo que no. no ah, ¿no la tiene? Eh, ahorita ya me las compartió ahí. Ah, ok, ok. Gracias. Uh -huh. Bueno. Vaya, este, en el recuadro eh, donde aparece la ficha, la información de empleo, ya la comienza a llenar usted. The floor. Ok, number seven. Armchair. 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 There is... An armchair, an armchair uh, next to the table. Do you agree, partners? <laughs> yes, I do. Uh, you are right. <laughs> no, I need practice, teacher, because uh, I, I ever said the way you always said that way. oh really yeah they ever say the wrong way siempre mm -hmm. lo he dicho mal pero ahora lo debo practicar para que no se me olvide Very y good. volver a crear hábitos yeah you're right you are right <laughs> yeah. thank you you okay, know carlos no. alfredo and galileo i think you guys should look for um also you should look for like a conversation classes because your English is already like, you know. Uh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, both of you guys, yes. And Sandrita too. Yes, yeah, Sandrita. Yeah, Sandrita. <laughs> Sandrita. All right, you guys continue, I'll shut up. There okay. is uh, an, arm, an armchair. Armchair. An armchair. Uh, next to the table in front of the room. There are an armchair, armchair, armchair. next to the table. Yeah, to the table. The table. There is an armchair next to the table. The TV. Number eight. Eight. I can see a TV. I can see a TV. TV. There is a. There is a. There is no a TV in the picture. Huh? Number nine. The cat. Yes. Cat. This cat like a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's terrific. <laughs> there is a cat uh, next to next to teacher. I'm sure. Question. I just yes. invent. I just invent. <laughs> may I? May I say? May I say uh, the there are a cat uh, in the uh, left side to the sofa. Yes, there it's is valid. a cat on the left side of the sofa. Okay. Uh -huh. Thank Very you. good. Carlitos, perdone. Eh, la tarea tres ya la toda la, la unidad tres la hizo Carlos. Uh, recuerdo que sí. Es que dice que ahorita estaba viendo y me parece que no la he hecho. Quiero revisar porque el viernes medio moribundo, pero sí las terminé. <ríe> sí, porque dice que me parece que toda la unidad 1 sí, la unidad 2 sí, la unidad 3 nada, la unidad 4 sí y el examen final sí. Uh, section 4. Section three. Mm -hmm. Sandrita, ¿y usted cómo va? Voy al día. Oops. Guillermo Sorry. me falta. José Eduardo me falta. I confused the 
this the unit I made a uh, unit four <laughs> and not the <a> unit three. <laughs> Ah, ¿verdad que no la he hecho, Carlos? No. Excelente, Carlos. Ah, pues sí. Ah, pues tiene tarea, Carlitos, porque sí necesito que la haga. Oye, y de hecho, así como que... Tú de... Ah, yeah. Ah. Very good. Ok, don't worry. I did say. I know, I know you will. Thank you. Okay, continue. The number 10. The number, table. 10. number 10. Number 10. There is a table between chair and armchair. Base. What's mean base, teacher? With Which one? Base. base. Number 11. Es, es el florero. Ah, it's a new. New Is a new word for you? Yeah. yeah. You can say yes. base or flower pot, pero flower pot es más como, como maceta. Base es como florero. Mm -hmm. base. base, florero. I got it. Base es como vaso. Ajá. Uh -huh. Más o menos. Yep. O sea, para, solo para hacer una referencia. Base, florero. Ay, qué bueno, esto es nuevo para mí. Ya me había aprendido tres cosas, Galileo. Yeah. Super. Yeah. You see, you learn something new every day. <laughs> do you agree with me, teacher? I totally agree with you. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're right. <laughs> okay, base number 11, base. There are, no, sorry. There is a base next to the lamp. Next to the van. There is a base next to the land. Okay, number 12. Lamp. Lamp. Is this the. Is. Ay, como se dice. No sé cómo se dice. Es lo inverso de lo que acabamos de escribir. There is a lamp. There is a lamp on next to the base. Okay, number three. On table. I'm sorry, Sandrita. On table. Yeah, on the table or next to the lamp. Or next to the base or on the table. Yeah, there is a lamp next to the base on the table. On the table. Okay, yeah. I made radio. 13, 13, radio. I can see a radio. There, there is not a radio. There is not. There is not a radio. There isn't a radio. Yeah. Pillow. 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 Well, there, there are two pillows under the sofa. On, mm -hmm. see, under. <gasps> no, it's the, on the sofa. There are two pillows. Mm -hmm. On the sofa. There are two pillows on the sofa. Or air chair, air, air chair. Air, air chair. Air chair. Air chair. Number 15. Flower. Flowers. Flores. Flowers. Uh -huh. There are some flowers in the base. Is is correct, sir? There are. Yes, you're right. Okay. Thank you. There are some flowers in the base. 
Do you agree, Alfredo and Sandrita? <laughs> I need to practice. Of course. Okay. Yes, yeah. Number 16, choose. Choose. There are there many are. choose. Are there are not any choose in the picture. Well, yes, sir. There are any, there are not any choose. Okay, I got it. We finished. Okay, Alicia. perfect. Very good. And did you, did you do the ID, Galileo, Carlitos, and Sandra? Yeah. I write down my do it just on. Um, oh, okay. It's like fine. a reference. <laughs> All right, yeah. that's okay. And did you ask Sandrita? Sí, lo habíamos hecho. Bueno, yo lo había hecho. Y le preguntaron a Sandrita, what's her name? What's her phone number? No, no not yet. Pregúntele a Sandrita Carlos okay. y de Galileo. Hoy que ella tiene que contestar todo lo que le pregunte. Okay. <laughs> Okay, yeah. Carlos, just do it. You have a, a better problem. I have two minutes, so hurry up and ask your many questions. Okay, okay. Carlos, go ahead. Sandra, what is your full name? Um, or your name? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I follow... Um, my name is. No. Escuché que me dijo Fong. No. No. Name. What is ah, your full name? Es que, te, es que te pregunto cuál es tu full name, o sea, todo, todo tu nombre. Ah, digo Fong, oye. Ok, eh, eh, my name is Sandra Judith Monge Torres. Ok. And where is your office or main phone? I I home my phone number uh, is uh, I home is visitor medical I have position see I have position visitor no. medical in department the no sé cómo se dice ventas sales Sales. sales. On the sales department. Sales. Sandrita, yes, Sandrita, and what is your your um your office number? Oh um, um is um Droria Americana. No, your office number, Sandrita. Your telephone. The oh, telephone yeah, number. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? Um no me lo puedo desde la office, o sea. Invéntese uno, Sandrita, no okay. se preocupe. Tú, tú, tú. <laughs> tú, 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 tú. What happened, Sandra? I got it. The last <laughs> name <laughs> is <laughs> two. Cada <laughs> uno. Ok. Six, eleven, three. Four, five. Excellent. Wow. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> that number is from Dubai. No kidding. <laughs> okay, Carlos, please ask me. Okay, Galileo, what is your full name? My full name is Jose Galileo Barrera Hernandez. Where is your office or main phone number? My office and phone number is 2501 And where? Uh, may I repeat, teacher? Yes, go ahead. Uh, 2501 7200. Okay. Okay. And um, where is your workplace? My workplace is Franquicia Internacional, SSLCB. Who is your job position? My job position is logistics. Carlitos, manager. you said who is or you said what is? What is, sorry. Uh -huh. What is your job position? My job position is logistic manager. 
What is your department? My, my department is QCC, mean Quality Control Center. Oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> quality control. Quality, quality control. <laughs> quality, quality control center. Control center. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, QCC, ay, que fancy se oye. Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> fancy. All right, guys. Oye. Yeah. <laughs> Sandrita, very good, Sandrita. Esperen, vamos a terminar okay. porque son las 10, all right? Wow, las 10. <laughs> <La diez. laughs> ah, sí, I remember that. <laughs> Okay, guys, it's 10 o'clock. I need to take attendance. Solo eh, a los que no mencione es porque están bien con la, la, la tarea y con el examen final. O al menos con las tareas. Pero los que sí mencione, sí estamos que me, me deben ahorita y necesito que se me pongan como al día. A ver. Um, bueno, Carlitos es con la 3, ¿verdad? Luego estamos Guillermo y José Eduardo. Me, me deben todavía la cuatro. José Eduardo y Guillermo. Sí, sí. sí. All right, nos ponemos igual. Hoy en la noche a adelantar con eso, please. Hoy la hago, teacher, en la noche. Tonight, all complete. Thank you, Guillermo. Thank you so much. Quiero ver qué me falta. Eh, y Luis Manuel, pero hoy no está Luis Manuel. Luis Manuel, y luego eso sería con las tareas de la cuatro. Judith, le falta el examen. Judith, ¿sí está? I'm doing it. Excellent. Dinora eh, Galileo, y me le dice mañana, please, the test, the final test. Elmer, igual, the final test. Eh, Gonzalo, igual, el final test. Guillermo, igual. José Eduardo, igual. Luis Alberto, el final y la cuatro también, Luis Alberto, y Luis Manuel igual. Eh, Rocío, solo el final le falta, ¿verdad? Creo que el examen, teacher. Sí, el examen final. Uh -huh. uh, si no le he mencionado, como Anita, Beatriz, eh, Galileo, Sandra, eh, Carlita, ya estamos, ¿verdad? Así que súper, thank you guys for that. A ver, eh, Rocío Adelina Cornejo de Contreras. I'm here. Carlos Alfredo Portillo Núñez. Present. José Eduardo Guzmán Álvarez. I'm here. Luis Alberto Ortega Linares. Present. Gonzalo Valle Valle. Ay, Gonzalo. Elmer Ubaldo Ramírez Cruz. Present. Edwin Balmore Flores Gómez. Present. Carlos Antonio Escobar Hernández. Ana Beatriz Pineda Olmedo. San, thank you. Sandra Judith Monge Torres. Present. Omar Alexander González Barrera. Omar. Ok. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro Corea. José Galileo Barrera Hernández. Present. Carla Marisol Escobar Arbaiza. Present. Ana Judith Portillo Bautista. Present. Guillermo Alfonso Ortiz Aguilar. I'm uh, here, teacher. Samuel Antonio Hernández Mancía, Luis Manuel Muñoz Acevedo, César Hamilton Rodríguez Castillo. All right, guys, very good. Los dejo ir a descansar. Sandrita, se me queda un segundito, Sandrita, y la vamos a regañar a Sandrita. Mentira, Sandrita, no se preocupe. All right, dígame, Galileo. Uh, have a little question. Yes. Uh, are there a final test? This day? Uh, are there a final test? Yes, there uh, is. Okay. Thank you. On the platform. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Así como el midterm, I am final. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. So work on that right now. Okay, guys. I'll see you all tomorrow. Solo, Sandrita, se me queda two minutes, Sandrita. No big deal. Okay, see you. Bye, guys. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Good, Good night. night. Good night, teacher. Bye, Carlos. The selecta is winning. Excuse me, Edwin? The selecta is winning. Is it? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> Finally. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Eduardo. Bye, Jose Eduardo. Lo vemos mañana. All right. Sandrita.
Hola, tía. La ya recibió el correo, en serio. Sí, ya lo recibí. Ayer. Lo recibí ayer, sí. Ah, vale. Bueno. Okay. Cuando, el... cuando yo le dije que no lo había recibido. Que no lo había no, visto. No lo había visto. Y en eso que yo dije, yo dije que no, y empecé a revisar y ahí decía encuesta, no sé qué, yo, ups. Uh, ups, all right, ok. Sí, porque de repente dije, qué raro, porque la mayoría ya, ya lo tiene. <risa> Entonces yo, sí, yo dije, yo le dije no, porque es que de verdad medio revisé y, pero no me percaté bien y que después cuando empecé a ver bien y yo dije, ups, ahí está. Y ahora me cayó por WhatsApp el mensaje también. Ah, ¿verdad? Es que se los mando en, la, en las dos vías. All right. Sí, Entonces, me lo mandaron y les contesté que sí, me pusieron gracias por confirmar. Ok, súper, very good. Ok, ¿cómo vamos con las preposiciones, Sandrita? Ya no está haciendo sus resúmenes geniales. <risa> ya me vio, ¿ver? <risa> no, no lo he hecho. De hecho, o sea, hoy estaba dando vía y yo dije, ay, que me preguntan ni les entendía lo que estaban preguntando yo dije bueno según el orden de lo que la teacher puso pues esto de ser y empecé a contestar ¿eh? ok pero All sí right. no, no estaba aplicada teacher mire le voy a sabes que le voy a dejar una tarea uh -huh. pero para que la practique de verdad las preposiciones del lugar Sandrita espéreme ahorita se las voy a compartir es similar al mapa bueno de hecho es eh, habían dos mapas solo les compartí uno All right. uh -huh. Ese es el A y está el otro, que era este. Entonces, quiero ver. Aquí están las preguntas. Si gusta, le toma foto a estas preguntas, Sandra. Ok. Ok. Y este es el mapa. Voy a mover. Ese sería el mapa para las preguntas que acaba de tomarle foto, ¿verdad? Entonces, la Ajá. idea es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Tal vez yo sé que pues, si le toca trabajar y todo, ¿verdad? Pero si en algún momento tiene chance, es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Es ir viendo acá, where is the restaurant, nos vamos al mapa. Y la idea es como poner en práctica todas las preposiciones, enfrente, a la par, detrás, eh, cruzándose la calle, across from, en la esquina de, ¿verdad? Entonces, trate de ir como haciéndolas. Mañana lo vamos a hacer juntos con ellos, solo que no lo voy a mandar a los grupos, sino que va a ser como individual. Entonces, por ejemplo, okay. yo le voy a preguntar a cada uno, ¿verdad? Le voy a dar una a cada uno y a que ellos se vayan ubicando. Entonces, igual, usted lo trate de hacerlo, tal vez le, le tiene un ratito por ahí y lo hace, ¿verdad? Y la idea es que practique las preposiciones de lugar, Sandrita. Oye. Ok, teacher. Para que usted ahí ejercite. Y haga su resumen genial. <risa> Póngalo ahí en su, en su, en su pared. Aquí atrás, ahí atrás tengo todo. En serio. <risa> ok. No, pero si sí le ayuda genial. Y aquí tengo, y aquí tengo la hora enfrente en el teclado la tengo. Ahí está, Ay, mañana se la pregunto. <risa> Entonces acaba de. La tengo aquí y en el teclado la tengo. Entonces, uh -huh. así no me pueden ver que estoy viendo ni para arriba ni para abajo. Ay, miré que es mala, pero ella hace su, su táctica, Sandrita. Entonces, <risa> cuando me dijo, yo me quedé, ah, veamos. <risa> yo estoy así como bien seria, ¿verdad? pensando. <risa> pensando, pero me estoy leyendo, tía. <risa> Very good, Sandrita. Pero siga, Sandrita, vamos bien. Oye, la idea es seguir. Sí, sí, no, yo sé. Pero gracias. Sí, estamos bien. Y mire que tenemos ahí la ayuda de Galileo y, y de Carlitos ahora. Y hoy estuvo, parece que a Sandra le fue, le fue bien con a Carlita, oh, con el compañero que estuvo ahora. ¿Con quién estuvo Carlita? Que estuvo con Guillermo, no, no, con Luis. No me acuerdo, pero sí estuvo con dos compañeros. Ah, no me acuerdo quiénes eran. Creo que era Edwin uno. No recuerdo. Sí, porque, porque dijo que le había ido bien, que había tenido Ajá, buena... ajá. Así que sí. que ponía celoso Galileo. <risa> sí, pero ahí estamos siempre para ayudarnos. Oye, Sandrita. Vaya, pues. Gracias, mis. Vaya, pues. Descanse. No me voy a le digo, estoy con la mitad de mis hijos, teacher. <risa> <risa> ok. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye.